Well, the man accused of killing UTA employee Kay Ricks made his first appearance in Wyoming uh, today. Central Utah Specialist Sam Penrod has reaction from the family as they begin the emotional process of going through a murder trial. It has been nearly 11 months now since this neighborhood in American Fork suffered an unimaginable tragedy. Now the family of Kay Ricks hopes today's court hearing in Kemmerer, Wyoming will quickly lead to justice. For the family, that, that's really their focus. Their focus is what happened in Wyoming because that's where Kay lost his life. DJ Harrison appeared in court this morning to answer for the first time to charges that he killed Kay Ricks after he was abducted in Salt Lake City in May of last year. His body was found in a remote area and his UTA truck was later found hidden in the trees. Harrison pleaded guilty and has been sentenced to 30 years to life for his role in a violent kidnapping in Centerville days before Ricks was killed. Harrison faces a possible death sentence if he is convicted in the murder. It's very difficult on the family, the ups and downs. Every time something comes up, they have to relive everything. And so now again, they've kind of closed ranks and huddled together and they're dealing with the, the memories. Um, of something that is almost a year old. It's hard to believe that it's almost a year old. Harrison's father, Flint, was also suspected in the crime, but he died of suicide in the Davis County Jail in July. DJ Harrison waived his right to a preliminary hearing today, meaning that the case is another step closer to a trial or perhaps even a plea deal. Sam Penrod, Live at 5. Sam, thank you. One of the